Hello there, welcome to Passivern. In this video, I am going to review Active Pieces, which is one alternative of JPR, Make.com, and IFTTT. Also, it's an alternative of Public Connect, I think. So, it's an automation software that will help you to automate the business processes of your uh, company. And the pricing of this software is really cheap. Uh, compared to its competitor actually and see license tier one pricing is only 59 usg here you can have 20 connections 10 minutes sync time for uh, scheduled triggers and 10,000 tasks per month and if you need unlimited connection then you have to get at least license to actually here you will have uh, 50,000 tasks per month so these are the things now without further doing let's go to the dashboard of active pieces and let's explore how things works here but before going to the dashboard let me show you the softwares that are available or the connections that are available here see total 104 uh, connections are available here see guys there have air table there have asana then um, there have carl.com then csv file discord then figma facebook leads dropbox fresh desk uh, fresh uh, shell then gmail um, integration github then google drive google calendar google contact doc google form google sheet then http then imap mailchimp a lots of platforms are, are available here monday.com is available then salesforce available send in blue available slack available smtp server available then uh, spotify stripe trello telegram bot twilio uh, twitter then webflow zero uh, joho crm uh, zoom is also available youtube available wordpress available so these are the things actually hope you get idea now let's say you need any other software in your integration see they have one link just click on this link this page and then you will be redirected to here here you can request to add one new uh, software as an integration actually see these are the requested softwares already and these softwares are in progress actually hope you get idea here you can request your expected software to add as an integration hope you get idea now i will go to the dashboard see guys this is the dashboard of active pieces to create new flow what you have to do just click here on this plus new flow and then you will be redirected to this dashboard and see there have already some pre-made template you can use this template as you can see automate blocks writing with ai a step-by-step -step guide using open ai then um, the next template is chat gpt sentiment analysis of Zendesk ticket in a Google Sheet. Then the next one is send ChatGPT welcome email to MailChimp new subscriber. So these templates are available here. You can filter by ChatGPT content creation, social media, customer service, and marketing automation. Also, you can select um, your apps actually. Also, you can start from scratch. So let me use one template here so that uh, my video do not consume a lot of time. Just click here on this use template and then see guys here. This is the uh, automation flow actually here at first see and there have the google sheet and here you have to authenticate uh, so let's say in your google sheet you have the titles and uh, let me show you see here if i click here uh, let's say the name will be will be google sheet one uh, okay here google sheet one uh, yes and then if i just click on this connect and then uh, you have to um, authorize your google account actually let me authorize it and let me confirm everything and then click on continue so in this way it will be authorized and then it will be um, connected and then we have to save it just click on this save then what we have to do we have to select the spreadsheet as you can see here all the spreadsheets that are available in my google account you uh, will get so in your google account any spreadsheet that are available you will get here and from here you can select uh, for who is a spreadsheet you want to work uh, with this uh, active pieces actually and see on my google uh, spreadsheet there have one spreadsheet name active pieces that i have created right now and if i uh, want to select here see here is the spreadsheet so in in this way you have to select your spreadsheet and then they have include uh, team drive sheet so they are saying that it will determine if sheets um, from team drives uh, should be included in this result let's say no and then sheet one see in this active sh uh, sheet i have this tab sheet one let's say i'll also create another sheet sheet two here see sheet two has been created so you can also select um, for which tab you want to work here so let's say i'll select here sheet one and then optional input is available if i just click here uh, so max uh, rows to poll so um, you can select maximum number of rows 
for which you want to work so i'm not selecting here it so in this way you have to select uh, or you have to um, done this sitting actually hope you get idea and then we have to set up our open ai and see here we have to insert our open ai api key let me find my open ai api, API key let me find my open ai api key so here this is my open ai api key let me generate one api key and then i'll copy it and then i will go back here and then i will insert my api key okay here let me connect it uh, here uh, this is my api key and then save it and then it will be saved see guys uh, here the api key has been um, saved actually and then you can add new connection also here just uh, select here and then you can add another api key if you want and see uh, write a block title here you have to insert your prompt actually see write a block title about this idea and then here you have to insert here what will be insert new row value of a here see in this spreadsheet they have one uh, column a and on this column for every row one new um, article will be written by using open ai and see here the guideline will be in value b let's say here let's say i will um, write here one title as you can see guys in um, column a i have written best email marketing software so it will be the title of my blog article and then here is the instruction how it will be written so here you can change everything let's say uh, you want to add something more here uh, on column c on column d you can write here you can write anything that you want here just uh, here select let me show you here you can write anything as you can see here you can write anything so by using this instruction automatically this automation will be performed actually hope you get idea and here if you want to add new input just click here and you can input more things you can input the model as you can see uh, here this is the chat gpt model let's say i want to use this model and also there have temperature so if you are a expert in this field you can select what will be the temperature let's say in my case the temperature will be 0.6 so these are the things actually this input and th um, you can add here and here uh, have the uh, generate sample data so you can test the step here just click here and then the step will be tested see guys uh, here it has written the output unleashing productivity with notion so in this way you will get the output actually so it's working actually they are saying and then here have another connection so in this way you have to uh, connect one software with another so what it will do it will go to at first the google sheet and then by getting the data from google sheet it will come to open ai and then it will write the content and then it will go to wordpress and then it will send an email to you as a notification let's say so here is the thing now let's say you want to add another uh, software here. just click here on this plus icon and then here in the right hand side all the softwares will be added and then let's say you want to connect here maybe something uh, let's say you want to delay let's say you want to delay how much time you want to delay let's say uh, delay for um, maybe 67 seconds anything can be and then um, what you want to do let's say you want to connect then let's say facebook page let's say uh, after um, publishing the content on your website you want to delay 67 seconds that i have added here and then you want to uh, post one status about this blog article on your facebook page you have to connect your facebook page here and then automatically this post will be created every single time hope you get idea so in this way this active pieces will work hope you get idea uh, so the thing is very easy what you have to do you have to just connect one software with another software by using the api key or by authenticating it's very easy guys uh, so these are the things actually here now in this video i'm not authenticating my wordpress and my facebook page etc etc that's why i cannot publish it but if i want to show you one complete um, automation as you can see there have demo automation if i enter here See guys, this is on complete automation and here it can be published. You can turn it uh, on or turn it off. See, in every one minute uh, it will work actually. Uh, and you can do a lot of uh, types of automation by using this software. Let's say um, by using OpenAI and Twitter, you can you know, automatically post tweet on your Twitter in every five minutes or in every hour. And then you can increase the engagement of your uh, Twitter. So in this way, these active pieces will work actually. Hope you get idea guys there have a lots of software but still they need to add some more software i think because 
uh, 104 software is, is not enough so uh, if you need more software then you have to just here create one request these are the things guys hope you get idea after that they have runs if i go to the run section here you will see all the runs that you have um, done previously and then they have the connection if i go to the connection section then here you will be able to see what you have connected on your account see i have connected my gmail google sheet and open ai after that they have team here you can invite your team member actually hope you get idea very simple dashboard very uh, minimal dashboard you have to create your flow here and you will get all your team member here in the team section and in the connection section you can see what you have connected as of now and if you want to delete any connection just click here on this delete button and then here type uh, delete and then it will be deleted actually hope you get idea so it's really a great uh, platform if it works actually because um, the competitor of the softwares are very uh, expensive so if it can perform better then uh, it's really a good choice so if you think as you need this type of automation software for your business or for your personal growth then you can get this active pieces lifetime deal from AppSumo. i'll give the url of this active pieces lifetime deal in the description of this video just go to the description of this video and get the 10 percent discount on this active pieces lifetime deal it's an affiliate link guys if you use this link to purchase this i'll get a small commission without costing you any additional money so if you think guys this video is helpful for you then please consider using this link to purchase this amazing deal and the last thing is visit our website www.pacey1.com to get more tips and tricks about growing online business. Also join our VIP lifetime deal discussion group through the description of this video. And if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel yet guys, then please consider subscribing this channel. Thanks again for watching this video.